how much uh, work has been done on the open mainframe project and how does it work? The open mainframe project they was in first place for, uh, pivotal in setting up the special interest group. So um, the, the work with the, the open mainframe project is primarily around um, getting also uh, support from the mainframe community. And then uh, over time, what we hope to do is also provide education about open telemetry to the open mainframe community. And uh, uh, potentially also, as we see us as a project that is between or on both sides, we have it on the open telemetry project side, but also we are engaged with the open mainframe project. This is actually where the synergies come in because uh, the knowledge about the mainframe, this is with the open mainframe community, of course, and we would like over time also see more contributions from members of the open mainframe project to our SIG because then we can actually bring in the knowledge that is there into the open telemetry community. Who should join this SIG? Why they should join it? And now look at it from both perspectives, what they will get by joining the SIG and what the community will get to them joining. We are actively looking for more contributors to the SIG and uh, we are looking here at different vendors, vendors that are in the space of the mainframe itself, but also vendors that are in the observability space. Uh, we are looking for users of the mainframe to join the SIG. And uh, what we hope to establish by this is a proper representation of the mainframe in the semantic conventions of open telemetry, but also then uh, what we assume is we will get proper porting of the open telemetry components to the mainframe so that we are uh, adhering to the standards of the mainframe when it comes to those components. And what the community will get is uh, the mainframe will become part of the open telemetry, but also part of the larger observability ecosystem. 